it's fall, y'all. Cue the leaf transitions. Looking good. Thank you. I have a hat. <laughs> so do I. And a scarf. <laughs> Looks like a Lego. It does. <laughs> Today we're trying fall flavored foods. So they taste like trees? Yeah. Tastes like dying plants? <laughs> In with the fall colors and the fall flavors. Ooh. 12 rounds? Of pumpkin spice. No, not <laughs> pumpkin spice. We've done the pumpkin spice. This oh. year is not the pumpkin spice. No, it's squash spice. It's all the other spices. <laughs> Round one. Might be 10, might be 12, we don't know. Oh! What are this? Give thanks. Gracias. <laughs> Favorite day, Toasty Brown Butter Indulgent Snack Mix. Oh, is this popcorn? Indulgent snack. Looks like caramel popcorn, my Let's friend. See. Who makes these things? Oh. oh! Oh, one of these Where'd you get boys. a potato chip? Oh my gosh. Potato chips? Those are potato chips. With popcorn, pretzels, and potato chips. Yeah. Oh, man. I'm just gonna have this big old wad of stuff. Dang. Oh, look, there's a tiny pretzel or a chip. You can indulge yourself on that, that's for sure. Oh my gosh. Oh, good. I would eat that entire bag. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. No problem. Got that myself. That's yeah. really good. 10 out of 10, baby. Would recommend. Go get yourself some toasted butter pop popcorn. Round two. You know what's hilarious is we were planning this episode to like not do the pumpkin spice. Mm -hmm. And then today I literally saw an ad for Aviation Gin featuring Ryan Reynolds. Mm -hmm. And his whole thing was F pumpkin spice. It was hilarious. I was like, yeah, time. Freaking help. Look like we're on the same page, bud. I've gone to that place. Oh, what are these? Pizza? Rico? Pizzas. Is this supposed to be like pizza? Maple? Little, little pizzas? Authentic Italian styled waffle cookies. Recco. Love Italy. Oh, bro, smell that maple goodness. Oh my gosh. That is such a beautiful smell. Man, I picked a bad time to be healthy, didn't mm -hmm. I? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I hear that. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm making waffles. I want to like, in put the it in my clothes just to be there. Oh, I want I want cologne to smell yeah. like hey, this. Hey, dude, why not? Oh, just take a dab of a little dab of makeup. Bro, that's right what in. we're missing. Women want to be comforted. Right? They want to be. They want something comfy. They, they want, want man to cozy. smell like maple syrup. You wear maple syrup. Oh, girls gonna be all Bro. up on. Be like all a, up. Be like on. a salt lick to deer, man. They should be up there like. Mm. Just right behind the ear there. Oh. I mean, I wouldn't mind. Why you taste so sweet? Oh. I feel like I need to dip it in something. This is very underwhelming. <laughs> a little bit of a letdown. A little bit? A lot of bit of a letdown. The smell and the taste do not correlate. It tastes like cardboard, smells incredible. There's, yeah, I need to dip it in something. Maybe I'm There is no flavor. That's unfortunate. Maybe it's because we just tried the most amazing popcorn ever, but this is very little flavor compared to what we just had. On a scale of but one to buttered popcorn, I gave it a crunchy leaf. Round three. Could any flavor be a fall flavor? Yeah, get up, man. I love it. Cranberry citrus sparkling what? water. Okay, you got to think of some Ted Lasso jokes. What, what does he say about sparkling water? TV, uh, it tastes like TV static? No. <laughs> it's exactly what sparkling water tastes like. It's, it's TV right? static. Right, dude? All right, okay, okay, smell. Smells it's got a good promising. Smell. I love cheers in you, man. I just, hold the phone. Where's the cranberry? That's actually enjoyable though. For a sparkling water, bro, I've had sparkling water that tastes like Chlorine. Bro, I'll take a flat water over this any day. Oh, I mean, it's not bad. Like if you're, if you're wanting to try sparkling waters, this is easily the best sparkling water I've ever had. Oh gosh. Not bad. I'm surprised. Color on me a scale surprised. Of, on a scale of LaCroix to ginger ale, this is, this is definitely. Citrus. <laughs> just. Cranberry citrus sparkling Transported water. on truck near cranberry. All right. <laughs> oh, that's terrible, bro. That's like when they when they give you a Sprite at the restaurant and they don't realize the syrup ran out. That's exactly what that's sparkling exactly. water yeah. is. Poop, poop. T 
TV static for your mouth. Bro, I mean, okay, sparkling water though generally tastes like pennies. I feel like I need to adjust this. The tastes here at least this a little taste. bit citrus. It does not. It tastes like a penny that somebody dropped in a glop of cranberry off the Thanksgiving this table. It's a very delicious. You penny. picked it up and licked it like a fool. That's a very good penny. <laughs> Round four. four. Uh, oh, oh, pump the pumpkin spice. I thought we were trying. Pumpkin thought we were today. steering clear. There's like two pumpkin spice things. <gasps> All right, I'm not mad. I actually like pumpkin spice a lot. Can't be fall without pumpkins and spices. <laughs> Those are dusty. Hold on. They're goldfish, bro. You I didn't thought realize we were that. Donuts. Show them. They're goldfish. Dunkin' Donut graham cracker goldfish. They're pumpkin spice graham crackers in the shape of goldfish. Is the pumpkin spice actually made of pumpkin? Like, what if it's not? No, it's not. That's silly. All right, so pumpkin spice is cinnamon, ginger, nutmeg, allspice, and cloves. Is that you have what? It? Oh, cloves are those weird little stick-looking things, huh? So I think you're weird, thinking of cinnamon. It's weird. No, cinnamon's like a stick stick. I'm talking like the weird little, like, they have the little pokies out, like a little three foot or four. Yeah, they're dumb looking. <laughs> <laughs> just dumb. It's like a dumb plant. <laughs> I thought we were getting coffee from behind, and then I thought we were getting donuts, and then you pour these He's out. out it's goldfish. It's all trickery. Get to our children first. That is Whoa! potent. That is a punch to the face of pumpkin. It's a bit much. <laughs> it's, a, <laughs> it's a lot much. That is, uh, <laughs> holy moly, someone had a pumpkin bat and Slapped us in the face with Also, it. from the color of this, it looks like it's supposed to be cheesy. It has potential. <laughs> potential lead to be in the garbage? If they did about half the seasoning, I think it'd be a lot better. Like, it's dusty. Like, don't breathe while you're eating it. Get some pumpkin lung. I will say. The grand part's good. You let your mouth acclimate to it, like get used to all the spices, and then it actually becomes pretty tasty. I'm starting to actually taste the graham cracker, which is fantastic. The graham cracker is good. Yeah. It's a cracker mm. of the graham. Now I'm starting to like them. Back when we were kids, we did it for the graham. Different kind of graham. Yeah. The, the graham cracker, cracker graham. Give me some of them Teddy Grahams. Oh, I love Teddy Grahams. So good. You can learn a thing or two, goldfish, about the Teddy Grahams. I'm not gonna lie, I'm Tonight. really coming around. Like I'm right. I'm thinking like More a seven, eat. eight out of 10. These are actually turning really More good. More you eat, they get, the better they get. I noticed that as well. These are actually really good now. That initial onset, a bit much, but. A bit much. I a bit it. much in that. <laughs> Round five. five. Oh. oh yeah, baby. Who's this? Carmela. Carmela Creeper. Ooh. Caramel apple flavored sweetened cereal with monster marshmallows. Dude, that's great. What? This is neat. He likes it. Hey, Mikey. <laughs> Where are the mallows though? There's like three in here. What a rip. <laughs> Tough times. Tough Please, times. You got all the mallows over there? Man, I wish I had coffee between each one of these. What are you doing? Look at the mallows. Get your dirty hands out of there. I'm just gonna get close to the edge and just get it right out. They're good, but. They're a little lacking. Not as good as I was hoping. Does it taste like caramel apples? It does. Mm. It does taste like caramel apples, but it's like a watered down caramel apple. Skim milk. <laughs> Carmella's all show. I bet you there's not even music playing in those headphones. Round six. Tis a jar. Butternut, Butternut squash, squash pasta sauce. This better be good. It always reminds me of Nutter Butt Squash. You don't like that smell? Oh, bro, it smells like baby it food. Smells like butt turnut squash. <laughs> <laughs> It looks like baby food. I mean, I, I feel like they get squash. Made with real cream. Made with real baby food. Italian traditional sofrito base. Hand-picked sage and a touch of honey. Cheers. Could use some cheese. <laughs> it's not terrible. It's okay. Here's the thing, when I eat Italian, especially spaghetti or even bow tie pasta, I want something hearty. I want some meat, I want some, you know, tomatoes. Some ricotta. I don't want any of this butternut squash. I just scarfed down a whole bowl and I thought it was absolutely delicious. That's what took her so long. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> like, hear me out, it's, it's pretty good. It just, it could use a little more seasonings and some more 
some cheeses maybe, maybe some ground beef, a little chicken. All right, it's, it is growing on me. It's kind of like those goldfish. Yeah, that's your... the thing with fall flavors. Fall flavors are like fall. It's like, hey, we're happening just like it. You don't have a choice in the matter, it's coming. Really, your taste buds do need to get accustomed to it though. What weird. A little Celtic salt in there. Some hand cracked pepper. How are you talking? Right? Yeah. This thing could be bussin'. <laughs> bussin', bussin'. Bussin', bussin'. Okay. Obviously, I'm eating more. I'm starting to like it. Wasn't my favorite in the beginning, but I'm, it's growing on me. I mean, I'll say, I'll eat this before I actually eat a butternut squash, so. He's got a point. Winning. Round seven. seven. Pumpkin tarts. You know the biggest design flaw of Pop-Tarts? I love how she kept herself one. Oh, I'm gonna keep this up for you. Oh! oh. Thanks, hottie. Uh. Biggest design flaw of Pop-Tarts? Wait, wait, hold on. 28 grams of sugar. Per right. half tart? No, for both. For both? Yeah. Biggest design flaw. They don't write the flavor name on the packet. Yeah, I wonder how we found that out. Right? Maybe it was like a Pop-Tart taste test. Yep, probably said it then too. Look at that! Ooh. I got a blister on my finger once from burning myself on some of that hot goo coming out the middle. Liquid hot magma. Liquid hot magma. Yo, Pop-Tart, I've probably said it before, can't you get a better machine that can freaking frost the other side too? It's got like... It's a garbage cut. It's, it's a, a garbage system. It's a garbage cut. You gotta up. That's it. a garbage cut. Where are you, Boston? Try Boston? It's garbage. <laughs> Get it, ah. I don't like pumpkin pie. You don't? <laughs> uh, okay, here's the thing. I don't love it, but I very much look forward to one, okay. to one singular slice of pumpkin pie. Once a year, so you can Yep, take. that's all I need. It kind of tastes like the brown sugar Pop-Tart. It's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. Would I pick it over the other 50 flavors of the Pop-Tarts offer? Sure wouldn't. Probably over like 30 to 35 of them. Was it in the middle? I don't know, was this one that we tried? I don't remember. I don't remember either. Oh, too many. <laughs> you tell us. <laughs> <laughs> if you watch it, let us know where we placed it. I would say, like, what would you rank that? If being realistic. I mean, if it, it I, fell overboard off a cruise line, I don't think I'd put that much effort into saving it. <laughs> well, I would hope Just, you wouldn't give any effort because you would die. That's what I'm saying. No, I Not I worth mean, it. I wouldn't even throw the dinghy. Someone else could use it. I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? If, if they happened to land in my house, I would probably have one. If it were in my house, open, put through the toaster and on a plate, ready for me, then I'd eat it. Okay. <laughs> Round eight. eight. Oh, dude, I just burped and it was not good. <laughs> So this one is actually a twofer. A twofer? Round oh. nine. Oh boy. Maple vanilla, bro. What is so, this? Is this that? So this is just plain Greek yogurt. And you okay. guys get to make a little yogurt parfait. Okay. Oh, my God. oh wait, so this is Greek yogurt? Yas, little flower queen. <laughs> Oh, this looks like it's a weird color. That looks, looks like baby poop. It looks like like baby poop. You should be concerned about because it's chunky. Pumpkin pie granola. Pumpkin pie. Maple vanilla. Maple vanilla. Ooh. You like mm -hmm. whipped cream? Dude, whipped cream is pretty good. On a big old mug of hot chocolate from Seals Cafe. Oh. So good. That's some fall vibes for you. They don't even know what Sills Cafe is. They don't need to. They got something just like it where they're It's like. a local thing. It's a mom pop diner, you know. Woo! That Greek yogurt is terrible. Uh, that, <laughs> that is some tart Greek what yogurt. What is that, bro? Like that is, <laughs> it didn't get the memo. <laughs> This is supposed to be a tasty, sweet wow, treat. Wow, that is so tart. Oh my gosh. It's like the kid they forced to be in your group project and you have to be nice to him. Oh. Oh. Ugh. I feel like it should be a vanilla Greek yogurt. You know what I'm gonna do? Throw it away? I'm just gonna take one of these, mm. put it with this. Whipped cream? Mm-hmm. Much better. Way better, actually. Incredibly better. Uh. Magic man. Right. That's that's mm -hmm. what we're looking for. None of that Greek yogurt crap. Right, because you're putting whipped cream on, on top of your pie. It's gotta be a vanilla yogurt. 
Oh, vanilla yogurt with this would oh. be incredible. A little pinch of cinnamon. All right. That would be good. That's really good. All these will have them listed down in the mm -hmm. description. Mm. That way you can find them locally if you need, or at least just have the names. Mm. Yummy. That is good. I Thank would you. definitely eat this every morning. It's giving bubble bath for me. Like, are we talking bath bombs bubble bath? No, like old fashioned, like gallon of soap in the bathtub bubble oh, bath. Oh, nah, man, this is giving me like- <laughs> with, with a sweet vanilla smell Bro. and some candlelight. Okay, candlelight. Can you see him? Something in candlelight with the bath Maybe bomb. Maybe a little Celtic salt. A little Celtic bit of, salt. you know, salt. silk robe. Epsom salt. Mm. Round nine. <laughs> Next up, we got that Sunbelt Bakery. Apple slice. Ooh, apple spice. Oh, apple spice. Granola bars. Nola bars. Oh yeah. Get in there. Dude, I love Sunbelt granola bars. Have you ever had them? I think so, just not in a very long time. They have this one. I want to say it's chocolate covered coconuts. <laughs> do the coconut. To die for. Texture of coconut ruins everything for me. Not How bad, not, not bad. I haven't seen this one. That's a good one. Looks, looks fresh, looks real. Ooh. Smells good, dude. So I'm telling you what, this is gonna be phenomenal because Sunbelt goes crazy hard on the granola bars. It's their, it's their jam. Oh, yeah. Mm. Not bad. That's oh, good. Man, it gets better the more you chew it. Mm hmm. Mm. That's really good. I like it. That feels like a dewy sunrise sitting on a rocking chair, you know? On a wraparound porch. Seen the wheat fields blowing the wind, sun's coming up. You got the hat for it. I got it. <laughs> Final <laughs> round. What is it? Give thanks. Candy corn. Candy corn crunch. Shut up. Dude, this is gonna be good. Candy corn crunch. Good. Do you remember what the flavor of candy corn is? Honey. Yeah. There's not much in there. Yeah, I was expecting it to be full. Huh. Interesting. There's wow, one. you actually got one. <laughs> Wait, there's no candy corn in yours? That is silly. There's Here, some in there. I'm gonna get another one. Oh, there you go. You gotta have it. What'd candy you make corn. this with? Like four candy corns? Yeah. Look at all the candy corns on the package. <laughs> yeah, there's like, no way. Yeah, I had to dude. look for one. I hate That's that. That's misleading. I do not understand. What's the white stuff? White confectionery bark. With peanuts and candy corn. Dude, favorite day, who are these people? I don't know. Pretty yummy. But they knock it out of the park. I like it. Yeah, for not even being the candy corn guy, that's pretty good. I'm pretty good. I don't what know what the white stuff white? is though. It's like a, kind of reminds me of like a big hunk, but not as chewy. Yeah, it's like a nougaty white chocolate kind of thing. Yeah, that's very good. Huh. Very good. What would well you done. say? What's your obscure reference rating? <laughs> it's just good. <laughs> it, it's good. All right, last round, right? Dude, no, that's it. Oh, that was it? Yeah. Oh, I thought we had another round. Mm -mm. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can't really say there was one item that I absolutely hated. Maybe True. just the cereal wasn't up to par as some of the other items. Even Man. the sparkling water for me was pretty delicious. It was gross. This was fantastic. A lot of unique flavors, lots of unique things. Yeah, good stuff. Stay away from the sparkling water. It's like watching the news when you were nine. <laughs> But we're not nine anymore, Cam. I know. And now we watch the news. Yeah, now it's force fed to us and it sucks. <laughs> das it. So Dumb. thank you so much for tuning in. We hope you enjoyed this episode. And uh, we'll see you guys here next time. Deuces. Leaf transition. Ooh. To what? <laughs> we just disappeared. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's fall, y'all. <laughs> Cue the leaf transitions. <laughs> Cue the leaf transitions. <laughs>